What's going on everybody? It's Rocco with Rocco's Modern Survival. I am back again with another duck video. Uh, you people seem to really enjoy the ducks. The problem is, is they are coming to you in a different uh, way right now. Uh, their greenhouse actually got trampled the other day. They didn't get trampled, it actually got destroyed. Um, from some high winds that we were having up here. So, it got blown away. There we go, there's the ducks. It got blown away, and uh, yeah, so I had to throw them in the rabbit tracker real quick. And this is just last night. So I've been uh, trying to do my best to get the rat the ducks uh, comfortable, so they're not um, they're not in danger or nothing. So I just went through and I wrapped this with uh, <laughs> just pooped with chicken wire real quick, so they so they wouldn't be on the too much snow and stuff like that. Um, even though they really don't mind the snow. The, uh, the only thing was, um, whenever I came down, because I wasn't at the house yesterday, or the day before yesterday, I mean, on sun, on Christmas, because, um, I was Christmas, and I wasn't coming, I wasn't coming to the farm, so I made sure everyone had enough food and water and stuff to last them uh, two days, so I, so I wouldn't have to come down on Christmas. Well, we had a really bad uh, snowstorm that day on Christmas, on Christmas Eve, and apparently... Uh, the greenhouse just got thrown to the neighbor's yard. I mean, it literally just, it got wrecked. I, I should be able to fix it, but it's, right now I can't do it because there's just too much snow on the ground. It's just too cold. Um, so they're, um, they're in the rabbit tracker. But what happened was, um, I was, I, I thought I lost them. So I followed the tracks to see if I could maybe catch up to them or not. Thinking that, well, they probably flew, flew away because I haven't clipped their wings yet. Well, luckily these guys don't fly very well, um, so they they, they just kind of flap their wings. That's about it. So I followed the trail, and the trail actually led me to um, back porch. And if you want to see those videos, go follow my TikTok. Um, I do I actually do do a TikTok on the ducks and farming life and stuff like that. My TikTok name is actually uh, Paul Ryan 1983. I think it's Paul Ryan 1983. Yep. Yeah, it's uh, at Paul Rowan 1983. It's R O W A N. Um, it's pictures of my bunnies. I only have 25 followers right now, but I just started this two days ago, so I'm not too unhappy with that. Good. Yeah, it's actually not bad for starting two days ago. Um, yeah, here comes somebody. They're, uh, the, I switched your feet up yesterday. Um, I put in what you see, the little, little chunks, is a little bit of cat food. Uh, I heard that cat food's really good for them in wintertime to uh, help start their egg laying because uh, these guys have not been egg laying and I switched their food up to actual egg layer food and they're not really happy with it they're not it's not they're not devouring it like they were their other food so I'm gonna just keep them on it because I already bought a bag of it so they're gonna stay on it whether they like it or not if they don't then you're not no, I'm, they're going to stay on the egg layer food because they have to, they're egg layers. Um, but as you see, I just threw some greenhouse plastic on this, and uh, just to keep, I stapled it in there real, real good and real quick yesterday just to kind of keep them in there. Uh, I hooked up a tie system to it right here. If you can see this right here, there we go. What you do is I literally just pick it up and I pull them every day. They were over there. They were right there yesterday. It's not kitty litter, Jacob. It looks like it. No, it don't. Um, and then I moved them just you know, a couple feet here. So they're going to eat the grass that's right here, and they're going to poop and stuff, and they're going to fertilize, and I'm going to move them to a new spot tomorrow. Um, and that's all I do. And then I just literally do this for the strap, and it just stays there. So well, what I have over here is I set up a little... This is for the rabbits, right? So the ducks get it instead because... Of, the ducks' house got destroyed. Um, I've got a separated spot here. I don't know if you can see it or not, but uh, it's got a wall here, wall here, and a wall back here. So they just kind of come in here, and they can just kind of hunker down in here for the night when they want to. I got it opened up so that way they get more air, because um, I didn't want to completely surround the entire thing with plastic so they wouldn't be able to breathe. Because this right here has, you know, this is the wall, so. They they would uh they wouldn't have any air, com air coming through so I left the top open. That's a full wall. Yeah, it's a full wall. Um, 
So, hey, why don't you unlock that and give them that uh, lettuce and stuff? So, actually, real quick, I wanted to show you guys um, one more thing that I'm working on this year. No, you can do it right now. I don't know if your kids are as lazy as mine is, but mine's about as lazy as they come. Is I'm working, I'm trying to anyways. Oh, they're doing really good actually, yeah. Um, ah, I got y'all stuck, sorry. I got my blueberry bushes under this uh, greenhouse plastic, and they're actually doing really good. I'm really surprised. And yeah, they're in sawdust or mulch but look how wet this mulch is underneath of it i've i've watered this i would say three months ago and i haven't had to water it since um my mint is starting to finally dry up a little bit i don't know if you can see that or not my mint is starting to dry up a little bit it's starting to die off but it'll come back with a vengeance um in springtime but I only got two raised beds right now. I haven't got nothing in that one. We won't have anything in it until springtime. Uh, and then we're going to turn all this into more garden and stuff like that. And we're going to turn that down there, the, the actual flat part that we could use for a garden. We're going to turn that into a quail habitat and a fish hatchery. Uh, so there's that right there. There's one thing right there. But we got to burn those big bushes and, or those, that big uh, burn pile and stuff. And we got to get rid of that thing. That was my grandpa's. It was. It's been sitting there for many years. So it's gonna go as soon as I uh, get ready to take the dumpster out of here. We did get the roof on though. Um, I don't know if y'all can see that or not, but we got a tin roof on there finally. So we did get that. I'm pretty excited about that. Um, and that door right there is actually not gonna be there no more. We've got it closed off inside and completely re redone and rebuilt. It, we just got in the springtime. We're gonna take it off and actually fix it the rest of the way but yeah we're slowly getting there we're, we'll be moved in hopefully by the end of february so that's one good thing but all right guys thanks for stopping by checking out checking up on the ducks i appreciate that um the, the ducks videos have been getting a lot of views so i just wanted to make sure that you all knew what was going on with them uh like i said they won't be in the greenhouse no more they're going to be in this little this little greenhouse uh, so um, so like always guys, thanks for watching. Make sure you hit that like, subscribe, and notification bell, and come back for more duck videos. And in actually a week, I'm sorry, two weeks, we should have baby bunnies. Um, hopefully. So yeah, so come back for those, and we'll hopefully have some baby bunnies for you guys. All right, have a good day, and God bless.